Hello, my friends. Welcome again. So we uh, add, we create uh, this in the user management. So create, update, and delete users. Now we need to change the password and search user by username and email. Okay. So first, I'm going to add the form here to create a user by username and email and uh, here I'm going to copy this one and pass it here so when we have this uh, create in the card header I add a div with class row and a div with a class call and at the form we an input with a type class I'm going to change this to search and I'm going to add a name here search okay and type submit search and here a div with a button to create and we change the link ashrep and I add the class button the same thing as here okay save and if I refresh now we have uh, this one okay uh, now the form we need to add a method and the method is going to be get action is going to be the road users index and if I save go to the user controller here and here we need to add the request okay and down there we make an if statement if the request has search I'm going to change the users to be user where the username is uh, like and um, the percent sign here user as a request sorry it's like as a request search and here or where email is like this copy and paste it here I get and uh, come here I refresh and search for the John search yeah we have only the John search for the Taylor and now we have the Taylor okay that's it how we can add the search uh, user by username and email now we need to change the password and I'm going to add to the to change the password inside the edit I'm going to add it here so go to the um, yeah here we have the edit I'm going to copy what we have in the register of authentication so here is the form I'm going to copy uh, from here and 
I'm going to paste it inside after that. Okay, uh, we don't need the username, first name, last name, don't need the email, yeah, we need only the password and confirm password and this is not it's going to be change password and also here update password save and refresh here and yeah this is how it's going to look now the method is post and uh, sorry is post and action is going to be uh, users dot uh, change dot password Okay, save this one and open the user model, user controller, or we can create a new controller for that. Okay, make a controller change password and sorry, make a controller change password controller hit enter and now open the web road and here we need to register that road road sorry post users and the user we need the user here and uh, change password and we need the change password controller here class and the method is going to be change password with a name sorry with a name uh, what we Add it here, users, change password, copy that and paste it here, save and now open the user change what is password change password controller yeah and here method uh, change password we need the request here And also we need the user import the user model and here first we need to validate the request and add the password and it's going to be required and uh, the next one is what we call it here password confirmation and pass it here and this one is going to be 
required as well and the same as the password okay now the user update and this can to update the password password field and call the hash make and the request password okay uh, import the hash here and I'm going to grab what we have in the user controller here uh, return redirect copy this one and paste it here with the user password um, updated okay I think we need to try now so here we are change password missing required parameter yeah here we need to add the user ID okay refresh yeah now add the password one two three four one two three four update password and yeah I make a mistake here and where is the backend change password controller Okay, I'll go back and try again. One, two, three, four. Again, one, two, three, four. Update the password and user password updated successfully. Edit again and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Update. And we don't show the message. And uh, why is that? The error? Sorry, that was. And why we not showing the error here? Okay, if we go to the register controller and uh, I think maybe we had only one. If I copy here and pass it here, save the refresh and now we have uh, yep yeah. yeah the password information does not match okay my friends now if I put the same thing we change now we have a, an error and I'm going to remove this okay refresh and past again one two three four five update password update and log out login again Taylor test test one two three four five and we are, we are here okay my friends this is for this video 
Hope you enjoy and see you in the next one. Thank you very much. All the best.